There are more than 75 cellar doors in McLaren Vale. Wirrawirra is one of the oldest and has one of the most widely recognised labels in the district. It also has connections that can't be ignored. Now, as you know, I try and dodge the, uh, the cricket as much as I can nowadays, hence the wine show. But uh, when you come to Wirrawirra, you can't really avoid it, to be honest. Bob Wigley, the founder of this place, played for South Australia. And there's just cricket oozing out of every... Oh! oh I've never seen technique like this. I know you can't normally take a glass of Chardonnay onto the pitch, but surely there's an exception when it's called the 12th man. I knew I should have been an umpire. It's not just the cricket themes that are familiar at Wirrawirra. These guys are old schoolmates of mine, and back in those days, we all thought we were impressing the girls when we bought a bottle of Wirrawirra Church Block. It's our core product at Wirrawirra. Um, we've been making it since 1972, and uh, it's, it's, it's great everyday drinking wine. It's... So it's been, it's been at the very core of a lot of young men's lives then? I would, I would suggest so. It's got a great and track record. <laughs> And, uh, Caelan, uh, do you have anything you want to tell me about Church Block yourself? I mean, look deep in my eyes and tell me... Mate, I'd rather not look deep in your okay, eyes. I mean, you're a handsome right, man. Right. OK, I understand. It's you. been a fantastic bottle. I mean, as Housie said, the quality is sensational. And, and the price point, the number that it hits, you don't come over too flamboyant and uh, it's not Tuesday nights and you go to the movies. That's right, and you can afford a second, <laughs> and well, afford a second yeah. bottle. Well, some of us need a second well, bottle. Well, I always did. I, I needed as many bottles as I could just to make myself look a little bit more, uh, well, palatable. Yeah.